hi in this question as you can see in the diagram that they have given a circle and there are points a b c d e which are lying on a circle f g is a tangent to the circle at d and e b is parallel to d c okay how we have to use that let us see we need to find all these unknown letters x y c and w so we can start with some circle theorem if you can look at this angle we have an alternate segment with this and with that we can get w so w is actually equal to 20 degrees okay now if you look at w and x they both lie in the same segment so x is equal to w is equal to 20 now we are done with at least two of them coming to what can we find next so next we can try to find y now for finding y we can use that parallel line point line eb and dc are parallel so we can see alternate interior angle over here and with respect to that if this is 20 then this will also be 20 so now i got this angle i can very easily try to work on y to get y value we can work once again for alternate segment so this is 25 we have an angle which is in the alternate segment to 25 and that is this angle so that will also be 25 now just have a look at this triangle in this triangle which i'm marking again we have the angles 25 75 20 and y 25 75 20 plus y that is all equal to 180 if you solve this 25 plus 75 is 100 120 it goes on the other side so 180 minus 120 and that gives y is equal to 60 once i'm done with y value i can finally talk about z value okay so for that if y is 60 this small angle is 20 this is 25 and the other side also it is 20 so I can get this missing angle because they all are lying on a line so the sum of all of them will be 180 so 20 plus 60 is 80 80 plus 20 100 125 and 180 minus 125 will give me 55 so this angle is 55 now we will work in the triangle which I am highlighting with a different color in this triangle if you see we have 55 plus 60 as one angle another angle is 20 and the third angle is z that we can find so z plus 55 plus 60 plus 20 is equal to 180 z is equal to 80 80 goes on the other side it will become 100 100 minus 55 is 45 so the value of z is 45 so finally we got all four values x and w both are 20 y is 60 while z is 45 you can try watching this video one more time if what i did in this is a bit unclear maybe after practicing twice or thrice you will get more clarity in these type of questions so try it out 